Understanding Source List, a guide for English learners. Hello everyone, welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore the phrase, source list. This term is commonly used in research, academics, and various professional settings. Understanding its meaning and usage can really help you in your English language journey, especially in academic and professional contexts. So, let's dive in. The phrase, source list, refers to a collection or a list of references used in a research paper, report, or project. This list includes books, articles, websites, and other materials where the information was gathered. It's crucial in academic writing to acknowledge where you get your information from, and that's exactly what a source list does. Think of it as giving credit where it's due. Why is a source list important? Firstly, it prevents plagiarism by crediting original authors. Secondly, it allows readers to verify information and explore topics further. A well-compiled source list demonstrates thorough research and adds credibility to your work. In academic and professional settings, Having a detailed and accurate source list is a mark of good practice and integrity. A typical source list includes 1. Author's name, the person or organization that created the source. 2. Title of the work, the name of the book, article, or web page. 3. Publication information, for books and articles, this includes the publisher, year of publication, and pages. For websites, the URL and access date. 4. Format type. Whether the source is a book, a journal article, a website, etc. It's formatted according to specific citation styles like APA, MLA, or Chicago, depending on the guidelines given. Let's look at some examples. In academic papers, the source list appears at the end, usually titled, References, or, Works Cited. In projects, you might see a section named, Bibliography, that lists the sources. In business reports, there might be a, Reference List, at the end of the document. These are all forms of a source list, tailored to different contexts. I hope this video has helped clarify what a source list is and why it's important. Remember, whenever you're engaging in any form of research or reporting, compiling a source list is a key step that enhances the quality and integrity of your work. Thanks for watching, and keep practicing your English skills.